Hey guys, today I'll be teaching you how to generate iConverting sales letter with just one click. And the good part is that this method is 100% free. Whether you are into e-commerce, freelancing, affiliate, or you are just a content creator, this method is going to blow your mind. So if you are new to this channel, I want to welcome you. And for returning subscribers, I want to thank you. So I want you to subscribe to this channel now and hit the bell icon so that you will get notified whenever I upload useful videos like this. That said, let's get started. The first thing you are going to do is to log into your ChatGPT account. It looks very much like this without the plugin or extension you are going to be using. But ChatGPT alone cannot create the sales letter we want without some prompts. So getting to know or writing all these prompts is where the issue is. That is why I'm going to be using an extension, the AIPRM Chrome extension. This extension is made for ChatGPT and it houses a lot of prompts, of which one of the prompts we are going to be using is the sales letter prompt. This prompt is a new prompt and it works like magic. All you have to do is to input the product name and the customer avatar. Customer avatar is the customer representative of the product. You are going to get some information about the customer that are likely to buy your product and you are going to summarize the customer avatar with the product name just in one sentence. It may be one line, it may be two line. Once you have done that, then the prompt will write the sales copy, sales letter for you. Sometimes this letter will have story, urgency, call to actions, open ended, everything you think, everything will be in it. So if you read the sales letter and you are not satisfied, you can tell it to rewrite using another model. Because this prompt can write sales letter using all the common model, Pastor, AIDA, Pass, and so many other ones. So let's get started. To install the AIPRM extension, you go to Google. Once you get to Google, just type in AIPRM for chat GPT. Now you see it here is the first Chrome extension. Just click on it and you have it here to add to your to your Chrome. Let's add it to the Chrome. Now that the chat GPT has loaded, it has loaded with the AI PRM prompt for chat GPT. But to make things easier for us, we are going to pin it. You just click on this uh, extension icon. Then you pin the AIPRM for ChatGPT. Once that is done, you remember the interface we had before. I think this is the interface without the uh, ARPM ChatGPT. This is it. this is the interface. Now, once you have installed the AIPRM for ChatGPT, the interface is going to look like this. So the interface has changed from this to this. So all you have to do is just in this search box, just type in sales letter. Now is the first one, write complete sales letter in one click. Just click on this. The moment you click on this, you will see the prompt active. You see it here, down here, write complete sales letter in one click. Then just put in the product name and the customer avatar. So let me just say you want to write a product we want to write a sales page for an infection product and there is this infection product that works really well and i have created a lot of videos for for them viral chill so let's say we are using viral chill as an example viral chill is the name of the product invention product uh, abba powder abba powder for people suffering from infection now this infection you you can just say sexually transmitted 
infections. So I have viral chill about powder. That is the name of the product for I'm describing the customer now. People suffering from sexually transmitted infection. Then the next thing is just eat enter and watch the magic. Now the beauty about this prompt is that this prompt is going to tell you the model is using the copywriting model is using is going to write you a story is going to give you testimonials is <laughs> going to put urgency is going to see it's telling us that using aida copywriting model do you see that that is the copywriting model it wants to use to write this copy it has started writing is putting them in sections for us and chat gbt does not write more than 500 to 800 words at a go so that is why you are going to when the prompt is talked because the prompt needs to know you're actually listening or you're actually reading so all you have to do is just type in continue do you understand so once it's talked now you will see that it will stop writing but the it has not finished so you need to just type in continue writing now if you look at this sales page is generating and you see that there is no story there there's no urgency there's no call to action there's no benefits there's no testimonial you can ask gtb uh, chat gbt why don't you put testimonial in this sales copy why not add urgency why not add call to action? Why not give me a story, an emotional story to sell this product? So because it's using this particular uh, model of copywriting, see, it's on testimonial now. Because it's using this particular style of copywriting, it might not see, I think it's talked now. But when you look at this, I, rec I can't recommend this product enough. You see that it has not finished. Just say continue. enter and you see that it will continue from that particular line you see let's wait for it while it continues see uh -huh. testimonial do you see that testimonials continued do you see do you see it has continued writing the testimonials now after the testimonial you should write the benefits after the benefit, you should write the urgency call to action. And after that, there should be a story in this sales copy, sales letter to sell our products. You see, wow, it's putting urgency. Now, see, that is urgency. You can change all these things. You can go through it again, modify. And the beauty of this thing is that it does not just copy you. See, what it generates now. It's not the same thing it's going to generate if you give it the same product to write about. Even if it's going to use the same model of copywriting, it's still going to change some things. And I don't think there's a story here. Let's see. Let's see. Now, I think it's about to finish. See, now it, ha it has finished. I'm done writing. Wow. See. You don't have to wait any longer. Just go and practice this prompt. Start using them now. If you look at this sales letter, it missed certain things. If you look at this sales copy he wrote, this sales copy does not have a story and does not have benefits. So that's because I know and urgency is there, call to action is there. Let me say include include a story in this sales letter see the story now it's generating the story that i'm going to use in my copy see i've never forget i will never forget the day i found out that i have sti I was devastated, embarrassed, and overwhelmed. I didn't even know where to turn or who to talk to. I felt like my life was over before it had even begun. For months, I tried everything to get rid of my symptoms. I tried over-the-counter remedy. <laughs> Can you imagine? This is, this is, this is massive. Otito, you have do. Do you see that? 
this is this is awesome do you see this is a story for the same sales copy now because it did not give me benefits let me say include benefit see if 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 you wanted to rewrite it can for you do you understand this particular prompt is massive is massive very very massive now let's say the product we are even talking about is not even health product we are going to try a course a facebook course uh, for small business owners and you will see that this same prompt is going to generate a complete sales letter from beginning to the end now if peradventure you don't see uh, a section of the sales copy see is done that's the beauty about this particular prompt it will tell you i am done so you will know that he has finished writing say let's say you want to run for digital product i've clicked new i will click here and i'll say facebook facebook sold out sold out for for small business owners struggling to make sales online good enter and let's see do you see there are small business owners struggling to make sales online are you tired of feeling like you are spinning your wheel trying to sell your product or services on facebook do you feel like you are tired you have tried everything but nothing seems to work well i have good news for you introducing the product name now why i put the product name here is because you could not figure out what the product name is but this is not a problem this tells you that when you have the script where you see the product name any tag at all just put the product name there now look at this one it's giving us pre-headline see the pre-headline here see the ultimate facebook marketing tools that small business owner needs. say goodbye to blah see the headlines discover the facebook so that i can help you boost your see the post headline now see the story let me share my own story wow this is mind-blowing see hmm? see the way he started the sales copy see this is a this is a game changer for copywriters for e-commerce for affiliates it's, it's mind-blowing now you don't have to reinvent the wheel you don't have to start all over again writing copy doing research use chat gbt it's free do you understand this is free and if i told you i'm going to even modify this we see that stopped writing you notice that when he stopped he didn't tell you i am done writing so when you see something like this just type continue if it, if this particular prompt is done writing it will tell you i am done writing that's another beauty about this particular prompt do you see fine it's done writing now if I did not see, I, he, he has put the testimonial, but I didn't see benefit. I think he has written everything together. Did, it, did I see the call to action? In conclusion. Okay, the call to action is here. See, the CTA is there. Now, if adventure, I'm not fine with this. I will just say, rewrite this sales letter using another copyright model i'm not fine with what you have written rewrite this particular copyright now let's see what it's going to do see it's using haida now pre-headlines headlines post headline this year section one attention interest
desire. See, this is massive tool at your disposal. When I found out about this particular prompt, I was wowed. If you find value in this video, kindly subscribe to this channel now. Hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever I make awesome videos like this. YouTube will also show these videos to others. This channel will grow while you also learn to apply things that will help your business. Thank you. See you in the next video.